Good afternoon. As you can see, things are slightly different here on Lease Women this afternoon. And that was, of course, because of the devastating news that we had yesterday. And that was our Brenda's son, Jamal Edwards, tragically passed away from a short illness. Now, any of you who regularly watch this show know that the love Brenda had for both Jamal and daughter Tanisha was massive. I mean, her heart was full of so much love for those children. So you know just how shocked Brenda is and just how hard it's hit all of us who knew him and of course, all of us who love Brenda. So what we're gonna do, Judy has joined on the panel today. You see there's one more of us here today because we want to do Brenda proud and um, you and I were with her last night. Yes. Um, you know, I think, you know, people see us on Loose Women, we're Loose Women and the rest of it, and we get on on stage and, but it's, it's so much bigger than that. The friendships that we build outside and the support that we give each other in, in different areas of life. And, and this is area, if I'm honest, I, I, I don't want to be here doing this. I don't want to have to do this, but we have to, you know, and it's heartbreaking. And all we can do is try and do the best to support Brenda mm -hmm. and honour her amazing son um, in such a difficult time. And we just wanted to be there for her yesterday. Um, yeah. Well, yeah, we sort of both, um, you popped to my house, we drove over and we yeah. went to go and see her because what do you do with somebody when they lose their child? You don't really know what the right thing to do is, do you? So we just yeah. wanted to physically be with her and Tanisha and to give them all the hugs and love that we could possibly give them. Not that it's going to, to help, but we needed them to know that they are loved. And Brenda gave a statement this morning, um, which I'll read some of. And the reason why I'm gonna read some of this is because the opportunity to share Brenda's loss and the family's loss, that was taken away from Brenda because of um, various people on social media who decided to tell Brenda's story and to tell Jamal's story without consulting Brenda. Yeah. Which was not fair in any shape or form. I understand, and we understand that a lot of Jamal's incredible work was done through social media and done online and all of those things, you know, he is a powerhouse. He changed the, the UK music scene. One man changed the UK music scene in a way that we've not seen for generations. He was huge. And I know you're gonna talk about Louis in just, in, in just a second, Linda. But what people have to understand is there is work life and there's family life yeah. and there is home life. Yeah. And it should have been Brenda that was able to choose when she wanted the world to know about her loss and that was taken away from her. So I'm going to read part of that statement. And it said, it is with deepest heartache that I confirm that my beautiful son, Jamal Edwards, passed away yesterday morning after a sudden illness. Myself, my sister, Tanisha, and the rest of his family and friends are completely devastated. He was the center of our world. As we come to terms with his passing, we ask for privacy to grieve this unimaginable loss. I'd like to thank everyone for their messages of love and support. Jamal was an inspiration to myself and so many. A love for him lives on, his legacy lives on. Long live Jamal Edwards, MBE, MBA, PhD. 